So the other thing that I want to talk about real quick, get into this, because it's obviously a, a, a pretty big thing, kind of ties into this whenever you really think about it, is a, um, uh, let's go over here. This is Scott uh, Sko, uh, the, the leader of, uh, of the Method Guild and the Method Org. Uh, I'm happy to announce Method Meta Guild, one of the fastest growing blockchain gaming guilds with my partners in every realm. Uh, I've worked very hard on uh, MMG, Mythic Meta Guild, um, uh, in the last six months. I'm excited to create opportunities. So, um, he's obviously announcing making the game, uh, or sorry, making a method like attached with this, uh, like kind of like blockchain type stuff. There are a lot of people who are not happy about this. And by a lot of people, I mean literally every single person in the replies, except for like two people. A lot of people are very, very worried. And Scott actually came out with a video clarifying some things, so we're going to take a look at it. And then afterwards, I haven't seen it myself, so I want to watch it first before I really have an opinion on it, okay, guys? So let's take a look at it. And uh, holy fucking shit, dude, yeah. And uh, reading replies to yesterday's announcement, sharing a quick video, clear up some points. All right. So there's a lot of drama, etc. Hey guys, good morning. Um, I just wanted to make a quick video about the announcement yesterday. But firstly, thank you so much for the, the support. I really appreciate that. And of course, all the feedback. I've read through all the comments. And uh, I mean, there is just a few things that I wanted to talk a little bit more about because um, I think it might have been a little bit confusing. Um, so firstly, Method Meta Guild itself, this is a new entity. It's a partnership with Every Realm. So it's a separate entity from Method, the esports organization, and the guild. So, you know, I find that to be a little bit disingenuous. I mean, you use the same name. I mean, you're using the same name. I feel like that's kind of obvious. I mean, it's, it's the same name. It's on social media channels. And I just want to talk a little bit more about what Method Meta Guild actually does. Uh -huh. um, so high level, it's very similar to a traditional esports team just thought it obviously operates in this new uh, sector of gaming, the blockchain gaming side of things. But um, in general, the, the focus of the, the Method Meta Guild will be to, you know, create content, um, you know, work with uh, competitors, build out an esports presence, uh, put on events, like just all the kind of stuff you typically see with, uh, with an esports team just in this new sector of gaming. Mm -hmm. I'm really excited, honestly, to see, you know, What's see blockchain where gaming? there. Like, uh, just in general, nobody I knows. do obviously understand, you know, a lot of people are quite skeptical about uh, blockchain. Um, yeah, of course. You know, in terms of the crypto space, there has been a lot of uh, bad actors and bad projects. There sure has um, been. But the technology itself is, you know, it has a lot of potential. And if it's, you know, used in the right way, I think it could be very positive and it could be a big win for, for everyone involved. Um, we're obviously one of the, the earliest adopters um, in terms of this, in terms of this new venture with Meta Met Met Guild. But, um, you know, I've had a lot of conversations with, you know, various different uh, esports team owners and companies in the space. And I know that they're all, you know, very interested in uh, the blockchain gaming side of things. A lot of hiring has already started and already begun in regards to bringing on, you know, people who are specialists in, in Web3 and, and blockchain. This isn't really saying a lot. Um, I think you're going to see a lot of entries in the, in the near future from, you know, from various teams in various shapes and forms. Um, but actually, there's, there's, there is actually esports teams that have already made an entry. Like, if you guys are familiar with uh, Team Secret from the Dota scene. Just making an argument they, uh, my LC. They made an entry a while ago. But, uh, yeah, I mean, just in general, guys, thank you for the support. And I uh, hope you guys have a good day. Okay, so let's read what some of the comments are. So this is what he said. Uh, this is not an NFT sale project. Method Meta Guild is a separate entity focused on blockchain gaming. Uh, Title is not WoW. Method WoW Guild is not hey involved guys, in this project. Good morning. Um, I, just um, to I, I think that there are a lot of people that are going to listen to this and just no matter what, they will dislike it and it doesn't matter what happens. He didn't really explain a whole lot. Yeah, I, I feel like this didn't really explain really anything i think the truth is that um methods had like a pretty bad reputation and to be honest i really respect scott a lot i, I do uh, i think the fact that like he was able to like method like i mean obviously he had like a tremendous fuck up with what happened uh in like 2020 right i'm not even gonna get into it everybody knows what happened it was probably the biggest fuck up that like any esports org has ever had in all time and the fact that he's kept it together and he came back and he got like world fifth or world third or something like that in uh, uh, the recent raid, I think that's commendable. Uh, because a lot of people after that happened would just pack it up and stop. And he didn't. He world second. Oh, even better. Yeah, world second. And he kept going. He kept trying. He kept swinging. And I think that's really fucking impressive.
Because I, I can't think of a single other person who would not just immediately throw in the towel right there. I mean, I know I probably would have. Like, I, I would have just been completely fucking defeated. Uh, exactly. And so, like, is that commendable? It shows that money's all that matters? I, I don't know. I mean, like, at what point is something money and what point is something like your passion, right? It's like he's done this for, like, 10 years, etc. Uh, I, I think it's probably a bit of both, right? He obviously cares about the money. Of course, that makes sense. But at the same time, like, being able to, like, rebuild method to a pretty good amount, I think that's commendable. Uh, I, I think also, however, because method has such a tarnished reputation and i think that'll become the case for really ever but like i think five more years really is people that that's like people's like uh i guess like their 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 recency of it and uh it's money makes you start an nft gaming brand i think that could be it too but i think method has always tried to go off and like do like these weird things and so i don't really know what's going to happen but i am very skeptical of this uh, I am very, very, very skeptical about this. How dare you want to make money? Well, I think there's that too, right? They bugged out the last boss. I still think it's still impressive. Hey, you know, <laughs> a win's a win, right? Uh, that's all it comes down to. It doesn't matter because blockchain gaming is garbage. Uh, do you know Josh is massive crypto bro now? Yeah, I've heard about that. Absolutely. And uh, is it time to, I don't think it's time to shun them, to be honest. Probably a good business opportunity for them to explore for the new mobile blockchain market. Uh, sorry, blockchain gaming market. I think the truth is that a lot of people don't want mobile gaming. And they, sorry, they don't want blockchain gaming. They don't want the commodification of gaming. They want gaming to just simply be gaming and not have it turn into some form of parallel to real life. I think that's fundamentally what it is.